You must have hated your pocket, Ronnie. So here we are. Remember the general equation of a line is y equals mx plus b. Today we're going to calculate b, which is the y-intercept, when we have given we are given the slope and a point. Okay? Remember when you give are given a point, that is a x and y value. In order to calculate your y-intercept, you can take everything you know. You know a y value from that point. You know the slope. You know an x value from that point. The only thing you don't know is b. So you can take everything here, plug it into your general equation of a line to calculate b. My y is 1. My slope is negative 4. Don't lose your negatives. We are multiplying the slope times x. Okay, and then our x value is 1 from our point plus b. Okay, now we multiply that, and now it's just a matter of using algebra to solve. Add your 4 to the other side, and now you have 5 equals b. You already know that we're given the slope. You now know the y-intercept, so you can write an equation for that line, y equals negative 4x plus 5. That was 11a number 11. Now let's jump down to 11a14. We are given the slope is negative 1 fourth, and we are given the point 2, 1. The 2, 1 gives us an x and y value. We can take our slope and our point and put it into the general equation of a line. We know a y value. We have our slope. We know an x value. We don't know b, but we can calculate it. So our y value is 1. Our slope is negative 1 fourth. Our x value is 2 and we don't know b. Now, how do you make any number into a fraction? By putting it over 1. So this is just a fraction times a fraction. You multiply fractions straight across. Numerator to numerator, denominator to denominator. This is a negative 1 times 2, which is a negative 2. 4 times 1, 4, plus b. I can reduce this here, or I can just leave it. I'm just going to leave it for now. Do I want fractions? No. So I multiply everything by something that will eliminate this denominator. 4 will make this eliminate or cancel. So I multiply everything by 4. I use parentheses to show multiplication. Okay? So 4 times 1 is 4. These 4's cancel, leaving me a negative 2. Do not forget your negative. Negative 2 plus 4b. Now it's just using algebra to solve. Numbers on one side, letters on the other. Add 2 to get rid of that. 6 equals 4b. Now divide your 4 over. 6 fourths equals b. Always reduce fractions. Both of those will reduce by 2. To where you get 3 halves is b. Now you know your slope and your y-intercept, so you can write an equation for your line. y equals, the slope was negative 1 fourth x plus three halves, and that is the equation of the line when you are given the slope and that point.